So that's the main goal of these videos is to show that these same base sort of concepts that are that are built into moving forward into our locomotive engine, as we would say, versus our reverse engine, our lifting engine are going to be present in our golf swing. And, and you know, a lot of these things have already been noted from the, the, the golf instructors of the world. You know, this is on the right side. They call it early extension, uh, but it's really just a front chain dominant move, right? It's a it's a tail to crown relationship. Um, being wrecked or being moved into a compressed state where tail moves forward and the crown moves back. They know that they would more so like to see this image on the left, which is the tail staying back, the crown staying forward, uh, because it's allowing the golfer to get the arms in the proper position. It's really just saying it's allowing the golfer to uh, keep the ball and sockets uh, moving in a fluid state. Now, they have the back chain dominance figured out, and they've also noticed that the head has to stay sort of behind the ball, as they would say, or really just saying that.